What's going on guys? Chaos here. So, back at again with another video for Baldur's Gate 3, BG3. Uh, so, we just... I honestly don't know if we completed... We didn't really complete anything, but we did save a, a deep... A deep gnome. Uh, we fought... This big old lady, and I'm assuming her boyfriend. We end up taking the goblins out on this side. This is where we rescued the deep gnome. He was stuck on the on this windmill. Took out gnomes. Uh, so fortunately, there's a bridge. I kind of want to see over here. I kind of want to see who this Karlak origin character is. Uh, it's saying she's somewhere over here. So we're going to check it out. But first, uh, I'm going to finish looting this village. But I am going to take a long rest because my guys are hurt. I don't think I, I probably want to do a long rest. I'll probably just do a a short rest, if anything. Oh. Okay, that's fine. Let's get out of here. Is it? <clears throat> Blighted village, that's where he went. Okay, so I did not clear so, Will, the spot. What was the blade of Frontier's was. toughest kill? Ah, it was a great scrap. A hungry miner to human flesh. Dude, that's my guy is just missed. Okay, I missed two of them. Cutscene right now? Is that what's going on? Um, what just happened? What just happened? I don't even know how you force end the turn. Okay, well that was that was weird. I... Oh, that took the edge off. Okay, I'll come back to the village. Um, have to keep going. Come back to the village a little bit later. What manner of place is this? A path to redemption? Or a road to damnation? Hard to say, for your journey is just beginning. What would suit the occasion? Hmm. The words to a lullaby, perhaps? The mouse smiled brightly. It outfoxed the cat. Then down came the claw. And that? Love. Was that? <laughs> they do know how to write them in Cormier, don't they? Well met, I am Raphael. Very much at your service. Neither. The fox, rather. Hiding, in a word. A silent observer about to break the silence. Hiding in a word, says Of course. Of what I have to say merits some privacy, as well as some more... Let's call it... Refinement. This quaint little scene is decidedly too middle of nowhere for my tastes. Come. Hmm. There, middle of somewhere.
The house of hope, where the tired come to rest and the famished come to feed lavishly. Go on, partake, enjoy your supper. After all, it might just be your last. <laughs> Are you not entertained? Well, far be it from me to disappoint. Hmm. What's better than a devil you don't know? <laughs> a devil you do. Am I a friend? Potentially. An adversary? Conceivably. But a savior? That's for certain. Oh, a mere trifle. How dear is one's soul, really? A rhetorical question, of course, but let me venture an answer. It's worth very little with a tadpole in your head. One skull, two tenants, and no solution in sight. I could fix it all like that. Hmm. Take all the time you need, but make up your mind before you're counting down with tentacles. Try to cure yourself. Shop around. Beg, borrow, and steal. Exhaust every possibility until none are left. And when hope has been whittled down to the very marrow of despair, that's when you'll come knocking on my door. Hope. <laughs> Such a tease. I'll be around, watching you squirm like a tadpole through a nice, juicy brain. All those Pretty little symptoms, sundering skin, dissolving guts, they haven't manifested yet, have they? One might say, you're a paragon of luck. I'll be there when it runs out. Okay. So obviously he knows something. He says we are lucky though, so... Oh, do you see that? Right there. I can go down the ravine, I believe. Yes, I can. I can... I saw nice. you training those children. You're so gentle. That's... Not how I was taught. Cruel words strengthen Once. neither heads nor hearts, Shadowheart. I wouldn't quite say that. Once, uh, I learned the lesson that after all. And came to resent your tutor, I bet. I taught them to fight, not to hate. Okay, so we're gonna charge ourselves. Oh, I'm gonna do it. Arcane recovery charge. Oh, okay. Let's get on with it. Like it's will be done. Hmm. That's cool. So I can fly. Okay. Dash. Hide. Disengage. Okay. 
No one's stopped me yet. That's pretty cool. I like Action, it, I like it. Not reaction. What does she have? Yeah, that's all she has. Whatever comes, I'm ready. Let's see. Can only be used outside of combat. Oh. Hmm. Blindness. Lesser restoration. Old person. Calm emotions. Aid. I wonder what aberrations are. Okay. Have a lot on my mind. Let's get with my boy right here. Well, in it. What can I do? Oh, these spells I have equipped. Okay. Bone chill. That's nice. Um. I kind of want to take these off. Oh, did I just use that? I did. No, I don't want to do that. How much farther can I go? Look at this. Is there anywhere? Something's going on with these hyenas right here. Oh, the frame. The frame rate. Hmm. Broken. Oh. Don't want to draw any attention. Never wanted the easy path. Look at these guys. Okay. Uh. They caught us. Just hit this guy. Nice job. Oh, hey, look at that. Yeah, well, I say he shouldn't be able to hit me, right? Hold the person. Ooh. 
No. Oh, you think it's funny? Nice job. Victor's path. There you go. Nice job. Sleeping. That should wake him up, right? Nice job. Gosh. No, come on, boy. But they're really trying to take her out. Jeez. These boots are made for walking. Heading there. My injuries need tending. Watch and learn. Dude, Will, Will is dull moment. So, Will, what was the Blade of Frontier's toughest kill? Ah, it was a great scrap. A hungry minotaur with a hankering for human flesh. An axe-bearing mountain of fur she was. Gave me a nasty scar. I hope you don't mind if I don't ask to see it. Hmm. As I was taught, this must the beast reeks of brimstone and awful. What's going on? Every breath is thick with blood. You hear what comes next before you see it. The sharp snapping of bones and a yelp of pain as her body starts to twist and undulate. You watch with cold realization. This isn't the end of one life, but the start of another. Knolls can spawn from the corpses of dying hyenas. Okay. Oh. Oh. And that gives me exactly I need it. Yes. You land a swift strike against her skull. She yelps, then goes still. Good. As the life fades from her eyes, the knoll within her dies too. Good. Stillborn.
Dude, no way. Forever dauntless. I totally ruined that. Dollar. You're hurting me here, girl. You're hurting me. What? Why are all my eyes just despite everything? Ignis! I'm doing the greatest right now. That's crazy. Yes. On the victor's path. Um. Oh, it's action, okay. Another fight. Okay, so let's let's go. Six damage. There you go, nice job. There we go. Come on, Shadow Heart. It is. Good observation. Vile beasts. Nothing good is born from a corpse. Let them come. We will rip them from top to tail. So then no. Okay, so do Food, that's what we need, right? I will take all the food we can. Camp supplies. Bag around food, bag around food. Oh. Something is here. Whatever killed those gnolls might be nearby. Careful. Jeez. Oh, I should actually make some alchemy. Potions. Potion of healing. Eat salts. Okay. Back to me. No. Assume nothing. Actually, what is wits and blades always sharp? If I remember correctly, she has prayer of healing. Four eleven, four seven. It's an action, that's a bonus action. Oh, 
Oh, I can use it. Still alive. Okay. Still in progress. What to do? Can't slow down. Something's here. to rest here. Sword of Who, Who's there? Please, keep your distance. You're welcome to shelter here, but we've grave injuries to tend to. A devil, the most deadly foe we've yet encountered. We are paladins of Tyr, Lord of Justice. He sent us after an infernal being, straight out of the Nine Hells, hiding in the form of a one-horned tiefling. One horn? Then you mean Karlak, Archdevil's bootlicker. <laughs> you boot know her, licker. which means you know what the fiend is capable of. She slaughtered countless refugees fleeing the Absolute. Yesterday, she butchered an entire family without mercy. We were lucky to survive our encounter with her. Mm. Okay. Religion. Why? Uh... She ran toward the river when she saw we were merely wounded, not dead. Down the hill from here. She must pay for her crimes. If you capture her, you will have served Tyr where we could not. This is the sword of justice, blessed by Tyr. I've wielded it since I swore my oath. It's all I have, but it's yours if you stop her. Bring me her head, and Tyr will consider her crimes repaid. May the just God guide you. I don't really want to take it. So. If you want to go poking around in the cellar, be my guest. Plug your nose first, though. You've got him, mate. Corpse, half right to mush. Must have been down there a ten day or more. Okay. It was a toll house. By the time we arrived, it was more like a slaughterhouse. There's more monsters than coin moving down this road. Yeah. There's a locked door down the hatch. Doesn't look like anyone's managed to get in. If there's any gold left, that's where it'll be. Okay. I thank you. Oh, so what's going on in here? Need any supplies? With fewer mouths to feed now. Okay, this is where I can start selling stuff, All right? She'll probably sell that. Let's see. For 180, dude. That's crazy. Crazy to sell that much to me. Get the water. And the hormone bones. <laughs> uh, well. Scroll of Revivory. 960, is it? Oh. Drink this and triple your jump, jump distance. Okay. Um, I will take these. Scroll. Should it bring on the car's target? Hmm. Tia's name. The 
It's a level two spot. That's what's. I know. I think I just wasted my stuff. Okay. Well, let's see if we can go find Karlak. Down by the river. So she's somewhere over here. Looking ahead. Finer. Running hot. One horn. The stink of Avernus. Advocatus Diaboli. <sighs> well, I'll be God's damned. The Blade of Frontiers. Thought I'd shaken you for good. That'll teach me to underestimate you. Oh, wow. Bloody right. An honor to be chased by the Blade of Frontiers. But I... Ugh! A great heat roars through you. Her heat, fiery as the hells. Then you're lost in visions of demonic armies as you tear through a landscape of fire and blood. The blood war. You saw it from above as the Nautiloid passed through Avernus. This woman was on the front line. What was that? Evidence. Proof that you're a devil. A gladiator in the Archdevil Zariel's army. I can explain. But it's a whole situation. If you just hear me out... Another vision. Karlak's blade raised, slicing through devils, Zariel's servants, as her eyes dart around, seeking escape. Her rage and desperation seep into you. She is a victim of the Blood War, not an agent of it. She's trying to trick us. Don't believe her lies. You saw the truth. I never wanted to serve Zariel. I was enlisted Actions. in her army oh, against my a will, really cool forced to fight, a fight I did. When I saw an opportunity to get away, I took it. Finally home. Near it anyway. You served her. That's enough to damn you. You don't know what you're saying. You're asking me to trust a devil. Listen to sense now. So he approves. Don't want this to end badly for either of us. You know monsters, right? Better than anyone. Look into my eyes. Can't you see I'm not what you think? Shit. You really are no devil, are you? I've... I've been deceived. Oh, thank the gods. Thought I was gonna have to take your head. <laughs> you would have died in the attempt. But there have been enough threats today. Truce then, eh? Aye. Truce. I'm Karlak. But you already knew that. And you are... Your husband. Well met, soldier. Nice to meet a friendly around here. It's been tough going so far. I may not be a devil, but I can put the Blade's reputation to work. How would you feel about helping me kill some evil bastards? Little background, if your moral compass needs something to point at. You already know I fought in the Blood War. I was good. Really good. It turns out I've got a knack for killing demons. That made me a valuable asset. Zariel, the archdevil herself, made me as her personal attack dog. I played along until I could get the fuck out of there, but devils don't like to lose their assets. <laughs> Zariel liked it so little. She sent a bunch of goons, so-called paladins of tear, to take me back. Problem is, 
I'm not going. Don't worry, I'll lead the charge. But I could use your help. There's a lot of them, and only one of me. After that, we can team up. Take Faerun by the short hairs. Sound good? I like her. She looks like she could throw me over her shoulder and carry me to safety. Should the need arise. Hmm. Fuck yes! They cornered me outside the toll house just up the hill. Doubt they've gone far after the scorching I gave them. Ah, uh, hang on though. Looks like you've got enough backup at your side. Not sure there's room for me. I'll catch up with you when it's time to camp for now. But don't get to any of the fun stuff without me. Got it? Wait. You've been witness to a pantomime, I'm sorry to say. And I've played my part all too poorly. Hmm. I can say only this. Karlak's not the only one who's had a villain's knife held to their throats. I have never called myself hero. But I am bound to an oath. One night soon when we make camp. The veil will be lifted, and I'll pay my penance. You're not in any danger, I promise. I can't say the same about me. Well, man. Fine, oh, no, man. Uh... Are you sure? The blade stands at the ready. And just when things were warming up. He kept missing. Like, he legit kept missing every time. Uh, let's end this day. And let's go get Carlock. Uh, okay, so here's what we see. Hell's fire. She's coming. That must be... Zaria. Well, you've been naughty. And you know what happens when you're naughty. God damn it. Anyone but her. Well, you absolute stinker. You kept me a secret. Hmm. Oh, Mizora. Time to let the Hellcat out of the bag. Call me Mizora. I'm Will's patron, the fount of his power. My pet's been unruly, and his leash <laughs> needs a yank. We had a deal, Will. But Karlak's still breathing. I've taken more pleasant shits than you, Mizora, and at least those can be buried after. That's no kind of talk for a lady. By the way, Karlak, Zariel sends her regards. You told me! Devils only! She's a tiefling, not a monster! How precious. The little pupster's found his bark. Clause G, Section 9. Target shall be limited to the infernal, the demonic, the heartless, and the soulless. Karlak meets the criteria, pet. Trust me on this. Let's see. The point? Oh, yes. Thanks for the reminder. I messed them up, I guess. Oil burns in the fires of Avernus. The lightning storms of Dis strike his flesh. His soul passes through each layer of the hells, gaining their essence and their torment. And that's cool. better 
What the hells have you done? A promise broken, a price paid. You know the terms. Get used to the new form, pet. There's no going back. Some magic even I can't undo. Now, let's see how the frontiers fare without their precious blade. Karlak, keep an eye on him, would you? I'll be keeping mine on you. Oh, and Will, don't forget, our pact still stands. Ta-ta. That's pretty crazy. I'll be honest, soldier. I'm reeling. Will hardly knows me, but he chose my life over his. It's been a long time since someone stuck their neck out for me like that. He's a good guy. He's a good guy. You can say that again. When he was chasing me through Avernus, I thought he was just another sad merc. How wrong I was. Hmm? So they might get together. Trust me, I'll tell you all about it after we take care of the goons on my tail. Well, okay, maybe you could say it now. Help me kill those paladins of Tyr, and I'll tell you a bit of good gossip for your good help. All right. Hell yes. <laughs> Let's level her up. She's a barbarian. Danger sense. Oh, okay. I can add a class. She's a barbarian. Should I do a barbarian druid or a barbarian monk? Fighter. Because a barbarian just does strength, right? I guess I'll do barbarian and fighter. Now she gets that. Legacy over in Syrian Smite, so that's hers, huh? Okay. Hey. Dun, 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 dun. Oh. Hong Kong. damn her straight back to the hells just look at me i did what was right and mazora made me pay for it here's how it goes i'd be hunting devils and demons she said traitors and hypocrites heartless evils of all sorts but not not zariel's victims not innocent tieflings warlock packs tend to be unforgiving from what you know of them will was lucky he didn't face a more severe punishment Hmm. I'd count my lucky stars for it, but I reckon luck is on holiday. I'm only alive because my patron still has use for me. Yep. It's Mazora who grants me the power to conjure armor and cast eldritch blasts. Yep. Before I was infected, I could even call hell beasts and summon festering clouds, but I promise you, Every thrust of my blade and every flame I sparked was for the good of the coast. You gotta tell me, man. I can't utter the terms or circumstances of the pact. I can tell you most all else, but the pact, 
and forbidden, unless Mazora permits it. But I'll say this. The moment I pacted myself to Mazora, I have not regretted for a heartbeat. It was my proudest deed. It was worth the sacrifice. All I can give you on that is my solemn word. All right. Arcane hunger. Tiring business, isn't it? All this traveling and adventuring. Why don't we take a little break, hmm? Allow ourselves a few moments of rest? Gives me a chance to talk to you about something, well, rather important. We've been on the road together for a while now, haven't we? Hmm? Survived some perils, overcame some obstacles. Ever since you were kind enough to free me from that stone, I've seen you demonstrate remarkable guile and courage. The way you diffused the tension between Zevlor and Aradin. The way you stood in front of a crossbow to prevent a murder. The way you got Korga to release the girl. In short, I've grown to trust you. The reason I make a point of saying this is that I've grown confident enough to tell you something I've yet to tell another living soul, except for my cat. You see, I have this condition. Very different from the parasite we share, but just as deadly. Hmm. The specifics are rather personal, but suffice it to say that it is a malady I've learned to live with. Though not without some effort. What it comes down to is this. Every so often, I need to get my hands on a powerful magical item and absorb the weave inside. I see. <laughs> Are you telling me you're addicted to magic? I can say no more on the matter. Not now, anyway. Just trust me when I say it's all of vital importance. It's been days since I last consumed an artifact. Since before we were abducted. It is time. And by that, I mean it's imperative that I find and consume strands of weave at the earliest possible juncture. Let's see. We've already done the finding. In fact, you have one in your possession. You know for yourself how hard one such an item was, and it will be no easier when even more are required to assuage my hunger. There'll be danger involved, or great cost. Gee, this is a long break. Splendid. Bit of boldness will serve us well. As luck would have it, you're already primed to give me exactly what I need. It's me. I will consume the magic inside. What was a powerful artifact will be rendered no more than a trinket. But it will save my life. Even if only temporarily. Thing is, I don't know what artifact he is talking about. Good girl, magical. Oh, okay. He's an addict. I can feel it work. The magic, it's like a lullaby that sings to sleep the demon inside. A metaphorical demon, I haste to point out, but no less dangerous. And no less bound to wake up again to continue its ravages. Such is the nature of all monsters.
grateful as I am, the course of our camaraderie is much better served by not taking that particular detour. Not just yet. Sincerely, though, I understand I ask a lot from you with few answers in return. But in time, all will be told. Hmm. Obtained it in Waterdeep. Nothing there comes cheap. Wonder if the gods are watching me. It might be, my friend. Let's go talk to Shadowheart for a bit. So, Gale just consumes magical items like I do wine. <laughs> we truly are a group apart. Nevertheless, as quirks go. That's a new one for me. Yeah. Fine. What's on your mind? Must I? Thinking about it won't help. We know what to do, so let's do it. Find a way to rid ourselves of these things. Personally, I think finding this Halsin is our best bet. If we're truly desperate, we can try to convince that goblin gut in assisting us. I'm not too hopeful that a gith crash will actually prove our salvation, but worth keeping in mind. Okay. Alright, well, let's go to sleep. And let's do Karlak's mission. We should be good to go. Leave the camp. Oh, flowers, leaves, grass. I was raised in the city. Hot beating. I'm more used to feeling cobblestones underfoot than grass and fallen leaves. Before I went to Avernus, I'd have agreed with you. Nothing quite like Baldur's Gate, is there? <clears throat> Nothing in my recollection, anyway. Well, let's take these guys out. Are we really going to hunt a devil on their behalf? You brought her here. We won't survive another assault. Leave us in peace, and we shall leave you in kind. Cut the crap, Anders. I know what you are. Don't let her hurt us. Please. We just want to go home. Hmm. Insight. Come on, I can get it. I can get it. Come on. No. Oh, yes. Oh, the Archduchess will be delighted when we return with Carlac's head on a pike. I never was good at playing the coward. There well. is no beast here or in the hells I fear. Not with her ladyship's protection. Least of all, this dog. You'd do well to reconsider your alliance with this animal. She destroys all she touches. Useful in the blood war. Frighteningly dangerous anywhere else. Rage all you want, Karlak. Burn with the might of the hells. Zariel will find you. She will bring you home in pieces. And your little friends will have to watch. Unless we feed you their eyeballs first. Avernus was never my home. It was my prison. No. I'm free now. And I'm never going back. Holy moly, why did she get hit so much? Oh, I 
can I remove? Talk to me. Uh, target is out of sight. Okay, so I can't do any of those. I'm gonna have to heal myself. Big time. Take you. Now this is my happy place. I'm going to enjoy this. Nice job. Let's go. Nice job. Jeez. My gosh. No time for mercy. You can do it. You can do it. Why is it why does she have that? That's concentration broken, right? It is not. Okay, so the She has so much. She attacks me.
Let's go. I don't have movement. Soldier. Wow. Disadvantage. Target's too close. What? Dull moment. <laughs> Concentrate. Dude, why does she her throws are so good. Her saving throws. Wow. There you go. Nice job. Did she do that? Oh my gosh. That was a long one. Jeez. Kill the cultist later. Seeking help. Let's talk to Carla real quick. I won't go back. I'm never coming back. And if any of Mummy's little friends want to pick up where the others left off, they'll find nothing but a pile of ash. That's right, she won't. She can't. She couldn't even lay a finger! <laughs> Goes crazy. I'm not going to last much longer. Yo, move out the way. Never going back. What is going on with you? Come on, let's go heal her. to do it Whew. had to let off a little steam after facing off with those ignots granted the fire's lasting a little longer than it should how do I look well, she has tubes coming out honey I could go all night oh she's floating on me I like it hear that <laughs> infernal engine for a heart Let's me burn as hot as the hells. Seems to be running in overdrive since I left Avernus. Won't be seeing my mechanic anytime soon, so I'll just make the most of the extra heat. Just don't get too close till I've found a way to calm it down. Hmm. High pain tolerance and a dynamic duo of truly shitty bosses. But it's a bit early in the game to be getting into tragic backstories. Let's save the scar show for later. After we've worked up an appetite for tragedy. Meanwhile, I'll need to find someone who can tune up my engine sooner rather than later. Believe me when I say this thing is hot. The first time I faced down those paladins, they let slip there was an infernal mechanic in the area. A tiefling. He might be able to stabilize things, if I can find him. A weaponsmith, huh? Not sure if he's the guy, but I'd love to find out. A tune-up would do this rusty heart a world of good. Okay, well, we can go see him. Soldier? Soldier, no, man. Oh, me. Old Rusty? Sure. The year? Ten air. The place? A sleepy little town called Baldur's Gate. Our hero? Karlak. A not-knee delinquent from the outer city, with everything to give, 
and nothing to lose. I was a kid looking for a way to fill my days and make some cash when I fell into the wrong crowd. Worked for a guy I respected. A lot. Turns out the feeling wasn't mutual. Through the jigs and the reels, he made a deal with Zariel behind my back. You know Zariel, right? Archdevil of Avernus. She put this thing in my chest and set me to work. Well, to war. I learned quick how to stay alive. And the engine served me when it came to killing devils. Ten years of that. The okay. stories I could tell. Guy named Gortash. Politician. Inventor. One of these wheeler dealer types who seems to have a finger in every pie. I guess I was naive to think everything he got up to was above board. What did I know? I saw a job. A good job. With people I liked. Doing work I was good at. Sometimes I'm jealous of that girl. Oh, to feel so invincible again. Hmm. Okay. We were both part of Zariel's inner circle. Her by choice. Me by force. In the grand scheme of things, I'm inconsequential to Zariel. Sure, I've got the engine, but I wasn't even her strongest fighter. She favored me like a child favors a captive pet. Mizora envied the attention, I suppose. I'm sure when Zariel gave her the order to hunt me down, Mizora was delighted. Okay. I think we got enough about that. Let's uh, let's go down here real quick. Let's see what we the can rot get. of death. Delightful. That toll collector. Step carefully. There's a trap. Broken padded armor, broken club. Trap. Be cautious. Hopefully these guys don't hit the traps. Uh Trap. Can we disarm it? Let's go. Good to know. This will be fun. We got this. No. Matthews. Inspiration. Let's go. Nice job. Might as well take the stud shield. Let's check out the wooden desk. In pot. Ouch. Step carefully. There's a trap. Nothing. That. Uh, no. Another step forward. Stone chair. Let's sit on the stone chair. Click. Is that a click? So it's got to be in here somewhere, right? Hmm. Unless I have to deactivate the traps. Traveler's chest. Nobody step on that. I'm way too big. 
Bro. I'm way oh. too big. Reaction, not reaction. I'm not fitting through that tiny hole. <laughs> Okay, well, let's get out of here. I'm gonna have to do a whole like long rest again. Hey, well, I appreciate this is the end of the video. Uh, it was pretty cool. We got Carlock. I want Carlock. This whole plane she's, she's really cool. She looks cool. I'll the great design is amazing. I think it's tight. Uh, definitely for the next video, we're gonna go back to the camp or the Druid camp grove. And go talk to Damien about her so we can I'll fix that issue and then get that mission out of the way too. That way we can just uh, spawn back in this area. Because we still gotta go s save Halson. Halson is like. I guess somewhere over here. Okay. Alright, well. Uh, leave a like, comment, please. I would greatly appreciate it. I would greatly appreciate it. Any criticisms, I would definitely will welcome that. Um, hopefully you guys enjoy the video. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.